Hello guys, Mr. Fast 60 here, and today we're going to be talking about the Ashen Revenant raid. So there's this raid here. I gotta take pictures. <clears throat> so, oh, I don't have the sound that is not on. There you go. Um, I was gonna say it's very quiet. But <clears throat> now we have the Ashen uh, Revenant raid. It is a fire and water uh, raid, so probably one of the strongest that I can hit. And <clears throat> unfortunately right now we only have fives going because we're trying to uh, get to T4 so I'm not going to be able to kind of show you guys um, <clears throat> me hitting a level 4 or a level 3. So I might send a screenshot uh, to you guys about how much I hit but if we do hit 4s in the later uh, game but right now we're trying to scrunch into T4 but I can show you guys how much I can hit for... Um, level 5 so <clears throat> let's see here this is kind of my lineup water first because of the pet and then air second and then I have my um, ultima armor in the back because it just does a lot more damage I don't have a good air and water armor with me right now um, yeah none of the air and water is really good or up to date so that's why I'm using this lineup and I'm getting a boost for <clears throat> the water armor so the only things I'm probably going to change, we can kind of see and look at it, is I might change my main knight to the water one because it gets the water boost and um, <clears throat> probably it may hit the most, but we'll see. <clears throat> so I'll show you guys uh, my normal lineup, which is this lineup, uh, my first lineup, and I think this is probably going to be the best lineup that I have, but we will see in a short time. So I will see you guys. <clears throat> Actually, I can show you guys what I mean. I do 1-2, special uh, pet special ability, so I get to decrease, or I get to have a bit more defense, while also uh, continuously uh, using my, actually, we could just use pet special ability twice, so I can hit maximum, and see how much we can hit um, with it. So I'll see you guys in a little bit.
Okay, so I hit about 3 mil on a level 5, which is actually pretty impressive. Um, <clears throat> but I can uh, I forgot to change the pet special ability, so we'll retry that again, and then next time we can change our knight. <clears throat> so I'll make sure to look more closely, because I've been forgetting to do that uh, a few times before a lot of the raid videos here. So I'll see you guys in a little bit. Okay, so <clears throat> I hit about 3 mil there. Actually, hit about less than what I did last time. Well, maybe because of the stuns, but let's see here. Um, I probably will hit this one. <clears throat> Actually, I'll probably hit this one. The no one's already hitting. So let's switch to water now. And I'll go first. And then we'll do our air knight and put them in the back. There you go. So now I'm really curious to see how much uh, damage I'll do with this one. So I hit about 3 point, I would say 3 mil on average, or 3.1 mil. So we're going to do spe uh, pet special ability 2, and then we'll switch back to 1 later. So I'll see you guys in a little bit.
Okay, so I basically hit about the same, so there's not much difference, which um, which makes sense, to be honest with you, because I, I just don't have that much. The defense and attack doesn't change as much, so I'm just going to switch them back real quick. Okay, I just, I literally just messed up everything, but that is fine. Let's do that one, and then we'll do a water here. Where's the dual water? Water for armor. There you go. Water and water. And then we'll do ultimate armor there. And then that should be set up for the next time I do it. But right now we're uh, scrunching in. Or I think we're being scrunched um, right now between 5th and 6th place. So that's kind of why we're doing 5s. And um, of course I'm recording this late. So uh, that's also going to be a contributing factor to it as well. So let's see where we're at right now. So yeah, we're kind of scrunched between 35 and, uh, I mean, Imperial Soldiers and Wild Hunt's Wrath. And let's see here. Um, and we're basically fighting for, let's see, for the plus armor. So if I get six, if we get sixth place, we get 25 gems. We get one of the uh, elite materials and then one of the, who cares about the pet. And then we get the regular one. So we're fighting basically for the plus and like um, another pet and like 40 more gems. So that's why I'm like, I think we we should be okay. We'll just keep going up. But um, I don't think we need fourth place. But I mean, that's just me. That's just my opinions. But I mean, extra 40 gems would be nice. But other than that, there's not going to be much of a difference. Because we'll at least still get the elite material and we'll get the uh, plus armor. But anyway... That will be all for this video, so thanks everyone for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace! Okay, so I am back. So, as you can see from this picture here, this was my first attempt at a level 4. Um, with 15 minutes left in the raid, so I got about 4.2 mil. So, I've gotten about 4.6 or 7 mil before, so I've hit close to the 5 mil, which is definitely like the highest I've ever hit in a raid. Um, let me go to the other picture. So this is my second time hitting it. So I hit about um, an average of 3.9 mil on average, which is was not bad at all. It's pretty good, but uh, definitely my highest is 4.7 like, mil. But yep, that's all for the video um, that I want to show you guys. Thought I'd show you guys real quick so you guys would know the real um, hit for a level 4. Peace.